get caught up in the rapture so much, man, it just become a lifestyle. And all you end up doing is doing repeating history over and over. It's selling the same thing for the same thing over and over every day. A person out here, they do all of those scandals that bullshit and shit because they want to. Nobody else for the things that you do in life. It's your, you know, choice. I became homeless uh, because of uh, my lack of faith in God. Meaning that uh, I had to look to a substance. That's how I became homeless, due to my drug addiction and my uh, lack of faith in God. My supervisor introduced me to crack cocaine and uh, started using crack cocaine and uh, started using drugs with my aunt and my, a lot of my family members and things of that nature, but I love to hide. You know, you got to learn how to be homeless. The uh, disease of addiction and that, and that, and that, that lifestyle, it's nothing but selfishness. Then I went into prostitution and uh, to get the drugs. And once I started doing that, I ended up getting shot in my leg and going through intensive care. They had to learn how to walk all over again. It took me about six months to do that. Uh, they put me in a, uh, it's like a personal care home. But I wanted the drug so much, I was on my crutches and went back to the same spot in which I got shot. Um, seen all the blood and stuff that was all over the walls. and. Uh, Started back again using drugs and drugs and alcohol. And I, and I thank God that God has not took my mind where I can recognize and decipher that I can't, I can't live like this. Because homelessness, believe it or not, is not just, it's not physical. It's all in the mental. See what I'm saying? And if you deep, you can, you can, you can receive what I'm saying. Because you can be homeless physically, but when you're homeless mentally, so Some day you gotta say enough is enough. You gotta tell yourself that. Drug abuse is still one of the leading causes of homelessness. More and more people are put into homeless situations, but Reggie and Greg have recovered from their struggles and have shown that through motivation and determination, anyone can recover from homelessness and drug addiction.